Hey everybody, today we're getting in a Blade Runner from 1982 and honestly I don't know anything about this at all. Like, I know that it's uh, Harrison Ford and that it's like a dystopian future but that's pretty much it. Like I do know there is a, a sequel to it and I am planning on checking that out as well. Uh, but it's like made way way after this was made so I have no idea what to expect from either of them at all but I'm excited for them because I know that like uh, this one at least it's got like I'm not sure if it did really well when it first came out, but I know it's got like a huge following, like people who like this movie really like this movie, right? Like, so I'm pretty excited for it. So let's just get right into it. Uh, at the end, if you like it, make sure to give me a thumbs up and to catch my other videos, uh, be sure to subscribe. All right, let's do this. Virtual identical to a human? No, it's a replicant. Oh, dang. Let me guess, the replicants rose up. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so Blade Runners are replicant hunters, pretty much, or police. But how can you tell who's a replicant and who's not? 2019? <laughs> They imagined it really bleak. At least they had hover cars though. Those are cool. Those are really cool actually, whoa. Come in. Sit down. A retina? kind of nervous when I take tests. Oh, just please don't move. Is it to check to see if he's a replicant? You're in a desert walking along in the sand when all of a sudden- Is this the test now? Yes. When all of a sudden you look down- <laughs> Doesn't make any difference what desert- But how come I'd be there? Maybe you're fed up. Oh my god! You look down and you see a tortoise. It's crawling towards you. Tortoise? What's that? Oh my gosh. You know what a turtle is? Of course. Same thing. You reach down, you flip the tortoise over on its back, its belly baking in the hot sun, beating its legs, trying to turn itself over, but you're not helping. What do you mean I'm not helping? Why is that, Leon? Why is this? This is weird, right? They're just questions, Leon. It's a test designed to provoke an emotional response. Describe it. Only the good things that come into your mind. About your mother? Let me tell you about my mother. Whoa! Holy! Was he an assassin or something? Like, what the heck? What just happened? Whoa. Hey, you are. Who are these guys? Admiral Kovacin Engambite. He's saying you're under arrest, Mr. Decker. For what? The Vaja Plague. He say you Blade Runner. Captain Brian Is he a Blade Runner? World seems like super overpopulated. Hi, you dick. I've got four skin jobs walking the streets. You say, what are skin jobs? They jumped the shuttle off world, killed the crew and passengers. They found the shuttle drifting off the coast two weeks ago, so we know they're around. Uh, are they replicants? No one's ever going to find out they're down here. But you're going to spot them and you're going to air them out. Huh. I don't work here anymore. Well, did he used to be the best or something? I need you, Dex. I need the old Blade Runner. I need your magic. Hmm. I was quit when I come in here, Brian. I'm twice as quit now. Stop right where you are. How did he make that? Out of that tiny little, like, that looks like tissue paper almost. No choice, huh? No choice, pal. Damn it. There was an escape from the off-world colonies. Three male, three female. They slaughtered 23 people and jumped the shuttle. Whoa. Three nights ago, they tried to break into Tyrell Corporation. I had Holden go over and run Voight comp tests on the new workers. Looks like he got himself one. So you look down, you see a tortoise. Okay. 
It was a test to flush them out. I don't get it. What do they risk coming back to Earth for? That's unusual. What do they want out of the Tyrell Corporation? Yeah, that's a damn good question. What's this? Nexus 6. Combat model. Optimum self-sufficiency. Probably the leader. This is Zora. She's trained for an off-world kick murder squad. Oh my gosh. The designers reckon that after a few years, they might develop their own emotional responses. Then why make them? So they build in a fail-safe device. Which is okay. For your lifespan. They die after four years? Now there's a Nexus 6 over at the Tyrell Corporation. I want you to go put the machine on it. If the machine doesn't work? What do you mean by put the machine on? God, those are cool. Look at them. Do you like our owl? It's artificial. Of course it is. Oh, that sucks. I'm Rachel. Deckard. May I ask you a personal question? Sure. Have you ever retired a human by mistake? No. But in your position, that is a risk. Is this to be an empathy test? Fluctuation of the pupil? We call it void comp for short. Demonstrate it. Where's the subject? I want to see it work on a person. Mm. What's that going to prove? Indulge me. On you? Try her. I get she. I get the feeling that she's a uh, a replicant. Is it the same test that the guy was doing before on the on the other guy? Yeah. Someone gives you a calfskin wallet. I wouldn't accept it. I'd report the person who gave it to me to the police. Is that illegal now? The guests are enjoying an appetizer of raw oysters. The entree consists of boiled dog. You say boiled dog? Would you step out for a few moments, Rachel? She didn't answer. She's a replicant, isn't she? I, I thought so. How many questions does it usually take to spot one? 20, 30 cross-referenced. It took more than 100 for Rachel, didn't it? She doesn't know. She's beginning to suspect, I think. Suspect? How what? can it not know what it is? Holy crap. Rachel is an experiment. Nothing more. And she's illegal. There's, they're illegal on Earth. They are emotionally inexperienced with only a few years in which to store up the experience if we gift them with the past. We create a cushion of their emotions, and consequently, we can control them better. Huh. You're talking about memories. Implanting memories into them so every single one has a past life? Seems like it could be dangerous. Whoa. What the... What is that? Is that a fingernail or something? How does he keep making these little things? It's making me suspicious of him. What do we got here? It's quite a bit of pictures. Oh, he's the leader. Did you get your precious photos? Someone was there. Police? Men? A Blade Runner. Ah, <laughs> what the? Why is he hooked up to stuff? You not come here. Illegal. What kind of work you doing here, pal? Hey. 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 
Lord, is that keeping you warm? Morphology, longevity, insect dates. Don't know. I just do eyes. Genetic design. Just eye. I design your eyes. Hmm. Questions. I don't know answers. Who does? Well, what are the questions? Tyro. He knows everything. Big boss, he, he designed your mind. Your brain? <laughs> Not an easy man to see. You'll be cold. He's gonna freeze to death. Sebastian? Did he take, take you there? Sebastian why are you, who? Why are you putting the eyes on him? Sebastian. Like he's freezing to death. Where would we find? Floor number, please. 97. 97, thank you. Don't... Floor 97, that's a tall tower. Damn, that's fast. She was there the whole time. I wanted to see you, so I waited. Is he scared of her? You think I'm a replicant, don't you? He knows you are. Look. It's me with my mother. Yeah? He's implanted memories in you. You remember the spider that lived in a bush outside your window? Orange body, green legs. How does he know whose memories he used? The egg hatched. And a hundred baby spiders came out. Implants. Those aren't your memories. They're somebody else's. They're Tyrell's nieces. Ugh. Okay, bad joke. You're not a replicant. You felt bad for her. Go home. Can replicants cry? Yeah, what are all these other pictures of? Because they were important to that other replicant, right? It's like you've had a rough night, jeez. You all right? Or are you just getting to town? What the? Is that really the safest place to sleep? Holy shit. I'm lost. Don't worry, I won't hurt you. What's your name? Pris. Mine's J.F. Sebastian. We scared each other pretty good, didn't we? We sure did. <laughs> you want to come in? I was hoping you'd say that. <laughs> oh, that's his, right, it's, I thought that was like where the dumpsters were or something. That's where his front door's at? And why did her face change as soon as he turned around? The whole building? Plenty of room for everybody. Must get lonely here, Chad. Not really. I make friends. It's a hobby. I'm a genetic designer. What now? Yeah. Home again. That's a lot of locks. Home again, home again, diggity dick. What the? Good evening, fellas. What the heck is... You're my friend. I made them. What about your friends? I have some, but I have to find them. I'll let them know where I am tomorrow. Is she the other replicant? We've only seen two of the four so far. What is with that picture and who is it in the picture? Enhanced 224 to 176. That's handy. Center and pull back. What are you looking for here? Center and stop. Looking for who took the picture? Enhance 34 to 36. Stop. Enhance 
hands 15 to 23. Give me a hard copy right there. Oh, we're going to find out what that is now, okay. Finest quality, superior workmanship. But it's a serial number. Interesting. Not fish, snake scale. Oh, it's a scale. I Abdul Ben Hassan. He make this snake. Huh. So are all animals replicants? Like... Well, I guess if the whole planet looks like this, then there would be no place for animals, I guess, right? Like, are those real ostriches or are they replicants? Or a mini horse? What the? Abdul Hassan? Oh, this is your work, huh? Who'd you sell it to? Yeah. Give up the info. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hello. I'm in a bar here down in the fourth sector. Why don't you come on down here and have a drink? That's not my kind of place. Go someplace <laughs> else. <laughs> you just got turned down. <laughs> Effie Lewis presents Miss Celery and the Snake. Excuse me, Miss Salome. I'm from the American Federation of Variety Artists been some reports that the management has been taking liberties with the artists in this place. I don't know nothing about it. I'd like to, to check your dressing room. For what? For, uh, for holes. Holes? Uh, little, uh, dirty holes they, uh, drill in the walls so they can watch a lady undress. Is, is she a replicant? I'm just suspecting everybody of being a replicant. Like, he's suspicious of it, right? What? So if somebody does try and exploit me, who do I go to about it? Me. What? Yeah, she's the replicant. That's such a weird outfit. Oh my gosh. Oh, he missed? Oh, yeah, she's a replicant. Just run. Oh! Do replicants bleed like that? Oh, oh my gosh. She was a replicant, right? Like... There's the other one. Yeah, what do you want? Tell. Listen up. Yeah. Is it messed up from that? Yeah, what the hell, dude? Ryan. It's being summoned again. Oh. Brian's there. Right, that could you look almost as bad as skin jog left on the sidewalk. I'm going home. Four more to go. What? Three. Yeah. There's three to go. There's four. Then no, no, that skin jog you VK'd at Tyrell Corporation. Oh, Rachel disappeared, vanished. Didn't even know she was a replicant. She disappeared on him? So he's got to hunt her down now too? He's got a soft spot for her. There she is, right there. Oh, 
It's just so crowded. Oh my goodness. Leon. Damn, Leon. Oh. Damn. Just punch through the metal like that? Ooh. Those have got to hurt. Time to die. No, no. Oh. I thought she was going to come and save him. Holy crap. Shakes. Me too. Even though he's done it like a whole, he's the best, right? He gets the shakes, like he gets uneasy from doing it. Part of the business. It's good that you still get uneasy. I'm not in the business. <laughs> That's a fair point. What's he going to do here? Because we know he doesn't like the job, even though he's the best, so... And he's being forced into this job. Is he going to let her win, like, live at the end? I don't think he knows what he's going to do. What if I go north? Would you come after me? No. Someone else would, though. No, you would. Yeah. He saved him. He's only alive because of you. But somebody would. Yeah. Now that they know about you? You know those files on me? The incept date. The longevity. Those things. You saw them? Yeah, how much longer does she live? It's classified. But you're a policeman. I didn't look at him. Did you ever take that test yourself? Is he? There's no way that he's... Deckard. Is he just sleeping with a shot on his stomach? <laughs> but does he just like collect photos or something? So there's some old ones. But you can play. You play beautifully. Is he falling for a replicant? Uh. Whoa, dude. What the? Um, Will you kiss me? I can't rely on you. Say you kiss me. Kiss me. Does she want this? I want to. Put your hands on me. I guess so. It's just... The way he went about it was... Kind of, uh, you know. She is the fourth replicant, right? Like, I'm. Am I, oh. What is she up to? What you doing? Sorry. <laughs> Just peeking. Oh. Oh, uh, look at her eyes. How do I look? You look beautiful. Thanks. There's the boss. How old are you? 25. What's your problem? Methuselah syndrome. What's that? 
my glands like roll too fast. Mm. Hi, Roy. How did he get in through all those locks? You live here all by yourself, do you? Yes. Not anymore, I don't think. Three replic or two more replicants about to move in. How about some breakfast? I was just going to make some. Well? Leon. What's going on? Oh yeah, two of the but Leon's gone now too. I totally forgot. There's only two of us now. Yeah, it's just the two of you. We've got a lot in common. What do you mean? Similar problems. Ah, uh, he ages fast like they do. Is he good? Who? Your opponent. Oh, Doctor Terrell. I've only beaten him once in chess. Maybe he could help. I'd be happy to mention it to him. Better if I talk to him in person. Uh, that's not gonna go well. Will you help us? I can't. We need you, Sebastian. And I think if you don't help them, they're gonna kill you. We're so happy you found us. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't think there's another human being in the whole world who would have helped us. You weren't sleeping out front of his place by accident, were you? What can I do for you, Sebastian? Clean the bishop six check. Oh. You better come up, Sebastian. Ah. Oh. So that you could always tell by like the Terrell? the center of their eyes if they're replicants or not. I brought a friend. I don't think you were supposed to. I'm surprised you didn't come here sooner. I was expecting you. Ah. And the maker repair what he makes. Would you like to be modified? He doesn't want to die after four years. I want more life, father. Oh my. The facts of life. To make an alteration in the evolvement of an organic life system is fatal. A coding sequence cannot be revised once it's been established. So there's no way to extend the life once the life is set? Like once it's coded in? You were made as well as we could make you. But not to last. The light that burns twice as bright burns half as long. He's gonna hurt you, isn't he? Oh! No! Oh! He's doing, he's mounted, like, this is like Game of Thrones mountain type stuff. Oh. What's, what's Sebastian gonna do about this now? Just run? Sorry, Sebastian. You gonna take out Sebastian too? Hey, about to be Sebastian. Body identified with Tyrell. 25-year-old male named Sebastian, J.F. Sebastian. Got Sebastian as well. 46751. Did they have, like, uh, Sebastian's address on file? Hello? Hi, is J.F., sir? Who is it? Oh, this is Eddie, old friend of J.F.'s. <laughs> no way to treat a friend. Gotta stop by, then. <laughs> this is just stealing stuff off his car. <laughs> I like Jawas. <laughs> oh, they already know you're here. They heard you. I wonder how he's going to be able to take out two of them at the same time, right? Like, it's just him alone. And that that Leo one gave him a lot of trouble. Like, 
that other one saved that other replicate saved his ass so oh no all his toys they're gonna distract him and then they'll all sneak attack him right Or are they planning to hide them? Yeah. Hiding amongst all the toys that this guy made. He's suspicious of her. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh. Oh. Ow. Oh no, what kind of move does she got for him this time? Oh, shoot! Nice! Okay, I guess that's how he's gonna handle them both, one at a time. You would think that they'd be smart and come after him at the, like, together. Or he wasn't there. That's why. No, yeah, you could sneak attack him. Good thinking. Not a sneak attack anymore. Is he in the dead, dead body? <laughs> oh, he's quick. Come on. Show me. What are you gonna do? Oh no! Oh no! And he gives it back? I'm right here, but you've got to shoot straight. Straight doesn't seem to be good enough. Mm, shooting lefty now. I'm gonna give you a few seconds before I come. Did he catch his ear there? Why are you running from him? You still got your gun. You just gotta shoot left, that's all. Or are you out of ammo? Is that it? Oh my gosh! <laughs> he lost. I can see you! Oh my gosh! Not yet. What's happening to him? Oh! I'm gonna have to kill ya. Oh my god! Is he stuck there? Nope. Oh! Damn! Ew. That's a long way down. Damn, oh my gosh. Everywhere you try to go, he cuts you off. Where are you going? Just away from you. <laughs> it's just gonna meet you up there, I'm betting. All right, what's the plan here, pal? You've made it to the roof, but now what? Uh, thought he'd meet you up there. Oh! Went for it! Hang on, pal, hang on, you got this.
What are you going to do now? Yeah, I made the jump easily. <laughs> Is he gonna help you up? <laughs> I thought he would grab him. But for what reason? I don't know. Is it so that he could have fun killing him or is it because he felt bad for him? What's your plan here? I've seen things you people wouldn't believe like what attack ships on fire off the shoulder of orion mm. i watched sea beams glitter in the dark near the ten hours of gate all those moments will be lost time to die Seriously? Damn! So time is what saved him. Wow. And he was like really under a crunch. You've done a man's job, sir. Who's that? I guess you're through, huh? Finished. It's too bad she won't live. What's going to happen to her? They already been there to get her? Rachel? She's either gone or she's dead, right? Like, Rachel? There's no other way for this to end. Is she dead under there? Or she's just sleeping. Okay, she's just sleeping. You love me? I love you. Time to go on the run then. Are they gonna make it out of here? Nope, 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 nope. Don't go down that elevator. The unicorn. It's too bad she won't live. You know it's a trap, right? No? Or was he giving him a signal? Is that like code? I don't know. I'm confused there. Okay, so that's it for Blade Runner from 1982. And I'm kind of confused at the end there. Like, was that guy giving him a code? Like, telling him in code? Like, get her out of there? I, I have no idea. I'm confused by the ending there. But uh, great movie. I liked the premise. The premise was like really out there, right? Like, it was, some it was something really different, at least... For that time, I'm sure it was like wildly different or was it really? Because they had Star Wars and stuff around that time too, right? Hmm. Harrison Ford, great in everything he does. Um, I was suspicious of everybody. I thought everybody was a replicant, <laughs> but I was able to pick them out because you could tell like in the middle of their eyes, it was like, it was like they had glass in the middle of their eye. You know what I mean? But it seems like it would be pretty easy to spot. You know, like you would just have to shine some light on it. I don't know. I, I, I really don't know. I'm curious to see what the, the sequel is going to be about and how far, because this was made in 82 and the sequel is made in 2017. So that's like a really long time. And is that same amount of time going to be like the same time jump in the movie world? I'm not sure. But yeah, I liked it. Uh, if you liked it, make sure to give me a thumbs up. And to catch uh, my other videos, be sure to subscribe. Thanks for coming out, everyone. Have a great day.